is like putting some type of attachments uh in your marijuana or um it's like lacing marijuana here so definitely be careful of who you get who your source is or where you're going to um i don't know what state you live in right but i imagine obviously um even like dispensaries like just be careful of like um you know that all right um but aside from that here i'm gonna come back to that too but aside from that you could be um getting into um buddhism buddha you could be connecting with buddha um buddhists or could be one yourself right um something about striking gold or a gold mine something i'm literally seeing gold um something about striking gold or working with gold it says right here on my chakra balancing chart um gold clear quartz and diamond connected to the crown chakra enhancing balancing out your your crown chakra but i'm also getting somebody works in a gold mine i'm seeing like the works in a gold mine or works with 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 the the core of the earth or works with the earth like you could be um somebody who like literally um like digs out the crystals or or gold here i'm also getting um like loray caverns i took like a trip there when um confirmation excuse me when i was um younger and i was like so fascinated by it um you could work there or work with that or that is very significant um but back to what i was saying in the beginning i heard oh oh, oh it's magic and you know so you know okay i'm getting if you think someone is is doing magic or, or putting some type of attachments in in your uh marijuana magic right they are you're right i'm also getting um yeah that's just it you're right um whatever this is if you think somebody is doing some type of witchcraft they are um i'm also getting an energy where take what resonates leave what doesn't um there's nothing to fear here right it's 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 I'm gonna make a whole different read about about warfare and stuff another day. Um, but um, you could be laughing, okay? You could be laughing um, or think it's funny. Like I said, take what resonates with what doesn't because it's not for everybody. Everybody's not gonna think it's funny. But I'm getting forever. This is resonating with you. Think it is because it's not going to work or it's not working or something about it being too obvious. Like somebody who's doing this is just it's just very obvious. Um, it's like not secret maybe they're not even trying to do it in secret it's just very obvious i'm also seeing aquamarine but that made me like say aquarius so somebody could be dealing with an aquarius or have that in their chart all right i'm also getting like multiple epiphanies 333s i say this or somebody in your friend group or a past friend past lover um i'm also getting like yeah like something in in your um this could be also like a past um sexual lover um, but I'm getting like multiple epiphanies, multiple epiphanies after epiphany, after epiphany, after epiphany. They're about to just be shooting in. That's what I'm getting here. So pay attention to that. All right. I'm not going to dwell on that energy. You know, let's come back up in the cards. I'm still not going to dwell on the energy because they ain't worth that time. All right. But, um, you could be healing or have healed from a lot. And when I say a lot, it's very heavy on my heart. You could have went through a lot of heartbreaks or, um, there could have been, uh, a situation going on with your heart your literal your literal physical um heart um or specifically air air aorta 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 okay um something about that being healed okay i'm also getting um you've healed from things that should have took you out or like um that would have taken other people out like or, or did like you feel from things that you can like look and see that other people don't want to heal from or haven't healed from um and it's like you have you continue to do the work or your 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 ability to heal self is very powerful and even to heal um others what's going on here <laughs> is very powerful you could be a healer like the ability to heal yourself and others okay i'm also getting um me scratching my nose on the evil eye here people could be envious of this which is or intimidated i'm getting intimidated by your intelligence the knowledge that you have but it's like you can't help that you're noble like anyways um so i was gonna say like hidden haters but like literal haters in your face making it obvious that they are haters all right so it's like your enemies are making it very easy for you maybe that's why you think it's funny i don't know y'all this is just the download that i was getting and also i was getting a deep download about connecting with sand or working with sand healing 
with sand. I'm seeing a, a, a visual in my mind of like the little square um, sand boxes you put on your desk and they have like the little rake and stuff. You could have one of those or you would benefit from using one of those. All right. Yeah, sand to help um, ground your root chakra. So we're going to go ahead and go on with the chosen um, journey to fly, Empress, okay? Um, deck right now. Okay, Divine Feminine right next to Inner Child Healing. So again, I feel like you guys, um, or this is Inner Child Wounding, okay? So I feel like you guys are healing at this time. Um, or it's been very hard to go through this healing process, but you you can do it. You will get through this, or or this is what you're doing. You will get through this, okay? Somebody can have very curly, um, full, beautiful hair like this. This could also be you healing your hair, your scalp, your hair cells, um, which your hair is is cells, okay? Um, divine feminine energy. Um, somebody could also wear a lot of like lace fronts. Still looks beautiful. Oh, Kurt. Um, you are a divine feminine. Okay. I'm, I'm sure that you know this. Okay. Um, it says spiritual strength, intuitive, wise, creative, abundant, very loyal, yin energy, um, very nurturing, very beautiful and extremely em em empathic. Um, I'm also getting a light worker. You are a light worker or a healer, whether you know it or not. Um, I talked about this in a couple other reads. There goes the clear quartz here. You could be working with clear quartz or guided to. Or you could be connecting with someone. If this is not you, there could be a divine feminine um, energy in this read and a light worker in this read working together or being brought together with this um, new love here. Wow. And then it's like divine masculine. All right, we're going to take these. Powerful. Powerful. And the light worker is... Um, old soul very spiritual you're being called to step into the light you're being called to be the light worker this is this is healer teacher to make an impact you could also be a strong um magician but you're being called to bring the light to be brave to step up and be that bringer of light here or to shed light you also see um i feel like i also a big misconception even when i started my journey of a light worker is like Oh, everything is going to be beautiful and light and shining. And that's very true, right? That energy is very beautiful within you, light and shining. Um, but a lot of light workers have to, you know, she's in the dark, have to bring the light in dark places or have to shed the light on dark, you know, situations, whatever this is. All right. Um, but honey, divine masculine, new love and divine feminine. I feel like your divine masculine and feminine energy is balanced. I also feel like you're going to be meeting a lot of people that are, are part of your soul tribe, a part of a part of your journey that are also light workers, bringers of lights, healers, um, brave people, brave ones. Um, that 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 movie could also be very significant for you. The brave ones on Netflix. Check it out um, if you're resonating with this read. But there is a masculine energy, a feminine energy, and a new love here. So some of you guys are going to meet someone new, but I don't feel like it's just one person. I feel like you're going to be meeting a lot of new people who are, um, you could be dating. This could be you dating uh, or speed dating. Um, but I feel like there's going to be like that one person, right, that um, you're going to be open with or you're going to have this strong bond chemistry with, a very valued connection. There are a lot of cosmic um, value connections are coming towards you is what you're entering. This new love doesn't always have to be a lover. This could be a new friendship, um, a soulmate. This soulmate could be a friend. Um, but I do kind of feel like there is an energy of a soul connection with a male and female here or whatever your, your um, sexual orientation is, female, female, male, male, whatever this is, there is going to be a new love here. It's going to be very balanced. It's going to be very beautiful. Um, if you're not resonating with that, there is going to be a new friend, whether this is male or female, um, that it's like you guys are being called into each other's lives. T 10, 10, as I say this, um, whatever situation you were dealing with within life before is ending, it's closing. That chapter is closing. It's finished. All right. Or you could be at the end of like healing from something very um, heavy on your heart. And you're going to walk into so much new love in this, this next cycle. You could be seeing roses a lot or somebody could even want to come and give you roses here. But this is a good read. This is this is this is all like beautiful, good energy. All right. Let's do um 
light worker here. Gemini. Some of you guys could be connecting with the Gemini here soon or meeting a Gemini here soon. All right, I'm also getting, like, I'm getting a lot of messages about twins, okay? So you could be meeting your twin flame or somebody who shares the same soul, mission, purpose as you, who has went through the same um, experiences in life as you or somebody who has similar testimony to yours. All right, this is also on the lover's card in tarot. So a lot of love is what you're walking into and it's because you put out love or, or the love that you give is so pure. Um, but yeah, I do feel like somebody's going to meet um, a Gemini here or if you're cross watcher Gemini, you could be the light worker, divine masculine spirit. If you are meeting somebody new, like a lover, this person look good. I mean, look at this man. That you don't have to be um very masculine and cut like this, even though it's in this card. It's just gonna be somebody who's who's like very beautiful to you or very handsome to you. Like you gonna be you gonna be meeting some people or a person who look real good, honey, okay? Um, like even in this energy, look at this woman, like with her crown on her head, like literally and spiritually, like Okay, um, <laughs> like, oh, that's my daughter laughing. <laughs> okay, or this could be even a connection with, with your daughter, 1212 as I say this. Um, but new love here, this is you smiling, male or female. But I'm also getting something about like a mystery man. There could be like somebody who like got their eye on you and you don't even know. All right, um. This could Saturn, excuse my kids. All right, um, Capricorn or Aquarius. Yeah, you're going through some type of initiation, but I feel like this is the initiation um, for for a healer, light work, or, or understanding that you are that. Um, or I might have to cut this short, y'all. Or um, or just like cut it off for a little bit, cause my daughter with my son, they just. Be they be really play fighting, but they really be going at it. Um, but yeah, I feel like you're gonna meet some. You're gonna meet an authoritative figure here, somebody who's very like a, a emperor or empress is what I'm getting here. That's what this divine masculine and feminine is. But somebody who is um, a very high authority of power here. Um, this could also be somebody that you were separated from at some point in time. So this could be a reconciliation, or you could be you know releasing someone, and then again you're gonna meet somebody new. You're gonna meet somebody who you were really supposed to be with. Um, I'm also getting intuitively, this is this could be somebody like, if you're dealing with someone that like maybe a father figure or a mother figure doesn't uh, uh, approve of, I'm getting like, don't worry about that, okay? Yeah, don't concentrate on that. This is your life. Neptune, somebody could be connecting with the Pisces, all right? Um, or very psychic, this could be two very psychic beings coming together, or very two spiritual, mystical, um mystics magical beings coming together this could even be somebody that you've dreamed about or you've been dreaming about new love coming towards you or getting messages about new love coming towards you this is your confirmation that it is true all right side note here not gonna dwell on it there is also like some type of uh somebody who who is doing the magic here they are they are a part of some type of a cult here um they could be having their people watching you Tell them enjoy the show, baby. Okay. Um, I'm also getting uh, your lover here. Whether this is a secret crush or new lover, they've been watching you. There's like all eyes on you. What's that? So what's that song? All eyes on me. Who made, who made that song? All eyes. On... I don't know. Look it up. Maybe it's. I don't know. Look up. Is it Meek and Nick? What's that song? Um. Yes, look it up. What they gonna do, Meek and Nick? <laughs> all right, so maybe there's people trying to stop two people from coming together, trying to do all type of crazy which shit. Let them do what they're doing. All right, because it's about the the world card. It's about to be over, honey. Whatever they doing, all right. And you about to step into a new cycle. Yeah, achievement here. End of one cycle and being fulfilled in this new cycle. You could also be doing something on social media, the internet, or have a very strong internet social media presence. Um. And you're going to get a lot of successful, good results from this. 
But this new person coming into your life is going to make you feel very whole, very, you know, you, you want to feel whole within yourself, right? But I feel like this person is going, it's like two whole people coming together to experience more wholeness. I'm going to get one more card here. Yeah, but I feel like you and this other person, like I said, if you are dealing with somebody who's been going through the same experiences as you in life, you guys are both healing at this time or you're at the end of some type of strong... Strong healing of, <laughs> you're at the end of some type of strong healing process when it comes to the cycles of love. You are going to have major choices um, in love coming up or you have a lot of options. Like I said, you could be dating, um, but you're going to be with someone that's going to, sh that's going to share the same values as you. I also feel like this, you're going to meet somebody that's going to be your long-term par partner, somebody that you could potentially get married to. Um, or, you know, if you, you are dating with someone, if you already already with a person, I feel like you are with somebody who, you know, you could potentially get married to. Um, or somebody had a vision about marrying you. Or something like that here. But kindred spirits, partnerships, um, different unions, connections. This is just beautiful, honey. This is just, I mean, look at it. The lovers, the, the new love here, divine masculine divine feminine i feel like you guys both have a mission here to be in the light or to to bring light to raise the vibration um frequency of the universe it's like no wonder they try so hard to stop it but honey and once it's written in stone once it's it's, it's your destiny is your destiny this feels like somebody who has a a double mission here you have a mission with this person you know, you know the level of protection that comes with you and this other person. If you have a mission to be together and then have a, a double mission on top of that mission. That's why spirit ending this. Ending whatever cult is, magic is going on here. Um, whoever's trying to watch or whatever here. They're going to watch you get this love. They're going to watch you get this, this new chapter, this new love. All right. I actually hold up before we go, hun. See, because... <laughs> Yeah, with my with my Isik falling for confirmation there. Yeah, everything's falling. Um, what's that song? And let it all fall down. All right. Yeah, this is somebody that you could have been in separation from, or if you've been felt separated or disconnected from love, this next chapter of your life gonna have so much love in it you ain't gonna know what to do. But receive. Get ready to receive love, honey. Somebody can even want to take you. Look, with the wedding dress again. Somebody can even want to take you, get you by yourself on a trip. Um, This could also be somebody, Um, maybe you guys do have different um, religious backgrounds. But I feel like when y'all come together, this is going to be a very spiritual, passionate connection here. Allow your heart to sing Allow your heart and soul to sing with joy. Oh, you're going to be singing with joy. Somebody's name could be Joy. Somebody could um, write music, sing. Soulmate again. So many confirmations. Yes, this is somebody from your past. Or if this is not somebody from your past, right? If you ain't want nobody from your past, cool. But this is a past life connection. Two people who are finding, their, finding each other again. Wow, I noticed I said again. Wow, you have known each other before. Maybe this is why this person as well, because I feel like, you know, it's not just bad people watching, it's good people watching you as well as this person. They watch and like, I feel like I know this person and it's because that you do. Or maybe you're watching someone, you feel like you know this person. It's because that you do. You don't really know someone, you're not really meeting someone, you're remembering. You're remembering. I'm done. I'm getting out. True love. This is a love of a lifetime or a love that's been occurring for lifetimes. You get what I'm saying? It's like each lifetime you come back again to to find each other again, to to fall in love again, to 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 like it's like you guys have been going on missions together for lifetimes. And I feel like when you connect with this person, you're going to remember that. You have someone who's very attracted to you, that flowers again. Somebody feels like you're just like a flower and they're like, ooh, you smell good. Okay. Um, but again, yeah, I feel like you're healing family issues at this time. Maybe you guys both are because I feel like this energy is very mirrored. Or somebody's, you know, dealing with a situation if someone has kids, but that has to do with co-parenting or maybe somebody's healing issues with their parents like I said somebody may not approve of this relationship but it don't matter because your real parents is mother earth and father god universal god and it looks like uh those parents approve so not to be this was such a beautiful read 
this was such a beautiful read keep doing what you're doing keep keep um going through your healing process like i said i feel like this person is mirroring um you know they're going through this healing process as well somebody could also be going through some type of court situation that could be restricting them from you know coming towards you or maybe somebody you know there was a separation that that um occurred due to whatever um this court situation could be because i see um you see the thing in the background what's that called right here um somebody could also be dealing with a virga because in that read it talked about you know being freed here but honey, I'm going to do it one more time. Divine feminine, divine masculine lovers. This is a connection that cannot, will not be stopped. Enjoy this, baby. Peace.